She's Connecticut's most senior state lawmaker. And just four weeks after suffering a stroke, she is ready to go back to work at the Capitol. Chief political correspondent Mark Davis joins us live from the Hartford Newsroom with more on Senator Edith Prague's return to the Capitol. Glad to see her back, Mark. Yeah, hi, Ann and Darren. Good evening, everyone, from the Hartford Newsroom. She's one of Connecticut's best-known state lawmakers. She's been in the middle of some of the biggest controversial issues. And tonight, she says she's ready to get back to work. Just one month after suffering a stroke, the 86-year-old nine-term state senator returned to the Capitol today to help advocates focus on the need to simplify the maze of rules regarding home health care services. I can speak personally about home care. <laughs> so for me, this is a significant press conference. She says she never had a headache or any other symptoms, or at least she didn't notice any. My daughter came over on Christmas Day, and she just took a look at me, and apparently the left side of my mouth was pulled over to the side. And when she saw that, she got scared. She went straight to the hospital and then physical, occupational, and speech therapy. Today, no one seemed to notice any difference at all. Oh, so good you? to see you. You look wonderful. The only thing I have not gotten clearance from my doctor to do is to drive myself wherever I want to go. My advice for stroke victims is don't give up. You just keep going. She says she plans to resume her full schedule of committee assignments when the legislative session begins on February 8th. Has she thought about running for re-election again this fall? I have thought about running again, and I am running again for my seat. Well, I guess there's no hesitation in that answer. No, there's no hesitation, Mark. I feel fine. Yeah, so anyone who is lining up to run for that Senate seat, I think you better forget about it. And coming up on News 8 at 6, Senator Prey tells me that she is ready and willing to get involved in one of the most controversial issues that's expected to come up in this legislative session, repeal of the death penalty. Live from the Hartford Newsroom, Mark Davis, News 8.